Hey guys, welcome back. Today I am back to talk about my hair. What else is new, right? I'm here to talk about this hair. And before I do so, just make sure that you click the subscribe button so you don't miss any videos. It doesn't cost you anything. And also, um, hit the little bell button which tells you when I have a video popping out because clearly YouTube doesn't want to notify anyone. So anywho, um, we are here to talk about this hair. It is beautiful, guys absolutely beautiful so what I'll tell you first is this is from Y wigs they sent this to me to give my honest opinion I wasn't paid to do this review so I'm gonna just come by I usually try to give hair a fair chance and a fair shot so before I just hop on I don't really like first impressions for hair because a lot can happen within the first couple of weeks um, so I like to give it a fair shot. I've washed it twice, actually three times. And what I did with this particular wig is I did something a little bit different. I'll show you guys what the hair looks like on the inside with the cap and everything. But I did do something a little different with this hair. When I put it on, what I did was I actually ended up sewing the perimeter and keeping it on for about a week before taking it off. Usually I do take my wig off every night, but because this hair was easy to manipulate, and by that I mean I like it to look curly and like juicy every day, so what I do is I wet it a little bit, maybe put a little bit of leave-in conditioner and just scrunch it and blow dry it. Today what I did was I didn't even blow dry it. Last night I just wet it and dried it. I like literally just sat it there and I sat it scrunched down so that the curls just kind of pop and that's what gave it this look. So I've had it for about two weeks and I've been wetting the crap out of this hair but let's get into the specs and then I'll go into the pros and the cons. So this is the deep hair so you can either go Peruvian or Brazilian and I'm so sorry about the air traffic. It is what it is. This is where I live. Air traffic land. But um, Peruvian or Brazilian, I believe this is the Brazilian deep wave, but on the website right now I see the Peruvian deep curly. Um, but right now it's actually on sale. I see the base price is $83, so I will put the specific links in the bottom. This is just literally, I do either natural or 1B. I like me a 1B because I feel like it goes with my skin tone. So whenever you guys, I swear I do a video and there's always someone who's like, what length is it? or what color is it it's 1b and I usually do 18 inches I don't ever go past 20 because I end up cutting it anyway and I actually did put just a few layers in the front just to frame my face as you see but just literally in the front right here and right here and that's it so those are the specs the links will be in the bottom so let's talk about the hair itself very soft I've gotten so many compliments from this hair everybody loves it the curls are popping um as i said i did something different so, so every now and then what i'll do is i'll sew it down and i'll wear it a week at a time just so i can scrunch it up and what i do at, t at night to go to sleep is i literally just put it on the very top of my head and put my scarf on and go to bed wake up in the morning put a little bit of water do a little bit of scrunchy scrunchy a little bit of hair drying with a blow dryer and I'm out of the door it takes like 10 minutes for this to come to life but if I have time like say I can do it the night before what I'll do is I'll definitely go ahead and do it the night before rinse 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 and then just air dry literally just let it sit there and it's a little hot so um my hair dries so this is what the hair looks like in general I should have already shown you guys uh, a clip as I was going through the specs but literally it's so beautiful and one of the best things about this hair one of the best things about this hair right is the fact that I've had so many curly wigs before and they usually the curls don't start all the way at the top that is one of the best things about this hair because literally the curls start up here and so it just gives it a very full and beautiful look as opposed to a lot of curly wigs that I have had which have had beautiful curls they just don't start up here and that's been a pet peeve of mine so definitely kudos to this company for making sure that the curls start all the way at the top I'm not naive enough to I'm not naive enough to think that all hair is human hair based on the price, but what I can tell you is from what I have here, I absolutely love it. 
there has been a little bit of shedding uh, because I have been wetting it a lot obviously so just be gentle and be careful if you do decide to go ahead and purchase this particular unit um, you guys know I don't really do a lot of units that are like five million dollars like usually the range is between hundred fifty dollars to a hundred or two hundred dollars like that two hundred dollar range is usually what I personally spend when it comes to wigs which is what I usually like to bring to you guys and if it's any more expensive like than that then you guys will know but I like to go for very cost-effective wigs that are gonna last now there has been a slight and excuse that because I didn't sew it down today but there has been a slight tiny bit of tangling back here but it's curly hair but usually when I wash it out or rinse it out I'm able to just finger detangle it out so as you see nothing much and I've had this wig for a couple weeks now but it might also have to do with the fact that you have to take care of the unit but yes for the price, this is worth it. If you are like me and you don't like to spend a lot of money when it comes to you, like hair things, but you still want to look cute, but you still want to look cute, try this out. Um, yeah, give it a try. I'm with it. And I usually don't wear my wigs for like five years. Like I'll wear this for like a month and then I'll switch to another wig, which usually does help preserve the integrity of my wigs. So I'm basing this off of like when I wear it a month at a time. So I think that's pretty much it. Any more questions, let me know. All the links will be below, guys. Just click there, go to the website, you'll see all the specs, and then you get to pick whatever length would work best for you. But that's it today. That's it for this review. Thank you for watching and either click on the videos here to look at past videos or um, definitely click the link below. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Thank you so much for, for watching and I'll see you on my next video.